boy. It's chicken and blues still. Fuck! Damn it, jerk hut's closed. But they didn't go out of business. Some of the, one of the best venues in the country, that O2. I've been to probably about five concerts there and about 10 fights, fight nights. So Boscombe is my old haunting grounds. For years, I just sit out here and uh, just talk to random people. I figured I didn't know where to go today, so I'd run into someone I know. Lots of characters here. It's not the posh part of Bournemouth. Fucking hell. You'd think the Russians were coming. Shit coffee. Little cash generator. That's still taking money in Boscombe. Black cherry, what's that? There's a couple of these ones that were always cursed, like whatever went in there weren't gonna last. That used to be, I think, £8.99. I never chanced it though. Well, just like me, Boscombe's gone. Boscombe's gone the way of the dinosaur. It's a bit sad, really. Probably about a third of the probably at least 20% of the shops have gone bust. I have to find some other trouble. I'll find someone if I keep walking up and down here. Well, I'm not gonna lie, Boscombe's become a bit depressing. I loved it. I bet you if I headed up earlier in the morning, there's different crowds at different times of day but it's just like the same, but less. But I'm on my way to my old house. Uh, I lived with Lacey for eight years. She's hopped in the bath. We're gonna go to Chicken and Blues. Uh, I called her up, so there's no Effie's kebab. And uh, Chicken and Blues is the best chicken place you could ever want to have chicken. And um, yeah, I'm gonna see Lacey. Not seen, him, seen her in three years, lived with her for eight years. <laughs> Wonder what people think of me, fill them in their houses. People say Boscombe's a dump, but I actually lived in this area, Boscombe. Not as nice as these, but uh, see, Boscombe was the place to be. This is where the spas were. They used to come from London back in the day in the Victorian era, the Georgian era. And uh, lovely Tudor Rose. Bournemouth has one of the top 10 beaches in Europe, but otherwise, it's essentially an English garden. That's what I think. Lovely area here, but there's a lot of wrong ends that would come through. They would come through here at night, so you'd have to double lock everything. And this is my road. Beechwood Avenue, BH5. <laughs> he always had a good flag. Here goes. We didn't part on the best of terms. Yeah, say hi. So, hi. Don't worry, only 20,000 will watch this video. You've done over the whole house. You actually went through with it. <laughs> Hello, what is your name? What is your name? <laughs> God, the garden's looking good. Wow. Oh, we used to have Bongo Steve. He's like a... Middle class hippie knows all the Latin names to everything. He come do our garden for us. Mark, 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 mark. Look at the bum on you. <laughs> Holy shit! Holy shit! What do you rent this out as like an Airbnb? Yeah. Fucking hell! Uh, it's come a long way. I know. It was nicer before. And you opened up this door, you cut that out, that makes sense. My god. But that's my favourite bit. Yeah, because you like a, you like yourself a bath. I do. Yeah, you wait till you get rid of me till it gets nice. Oh well, yeah. Wow. 
Lacey, by the way, sells some of the finest microfiber products. Doggy bag, as you've seen Masa in, in my Sweden videos. And those towels will dry your ass back and crack. Um, this is my old bedroom for like eight years. It's uh, it used to be very, um, uh, it was vintage. Dated. What's his name? Oh, crying this one. Oh. She looked like a wicked witch when we got her. But now she's a beautiful princess. Hello, baby. She's like the most beautiful princess. Hi, baby. Mm. So soft. I know. Must feed him as fish oil. She's on organic uh, layers pellets, but then they're grass fed, really. When are we going to eat her? No, we're not. She's not fat enough to eat. This is boozy. Say hi, Brandon. And do they stay outside in the winter? They're all fine. Yeah. Yeah, um, I'll show you Ziggy got attacked by a fox this year. Yeah. And she survived. No, what's going on? You. No. Oi, oi, oi. Oi, oi, oi. They're like almost domesticated. This is Blondie. Holy shit. <laughs> hi, Blondie. Say hi, Brandon. Hello, look at those big talons on you. Hi. Hi, Brandon. Wow. Say hi. Whoa, Jesus, fuck. <laughs> Ziggy played this guitar. This is the one that got got by the fox. The fox took all of her fur. Oh god. Will it, will it come back? I don't know, probably that's why we got the cage. They used to just be out on their own. What, and they just... Mm. Chickens can't fly, don't be silly. <laughs> Look at his, I don't know what you call those, a gill? or You probably know everything about I chickens know, I now. I don't know. No, it's like a fake eye. Oh. That's the girls. I've never seen anything like this in my life. That is a chicken shit. Now just to give you, put the egg beside it, but not too close. And they're diggers too. They're peckers and scratchers. I've got a nice pecker. Yeah. <laughs> the chicken swing. Yeah. It's a swingers club. It's a swingers club. Get it. <laughs> this is a fine Czech automobile. I'm undercover. Are you? You do look a bit like Elton John <laughs> with them glasses. Look at all the poshies. And now, so we left Boscombe and we're on our way to Southbourne. Oh, I don't, I don't live we in got, Boscombe. I, I, what do you say, Southbourne? I say Southbourne. Or do you say, or do you say like Boscombe Heights? Boscombe Manor. Boscombe Manor. Boscombe Manor. Boscombe right. Manor. Okay. No, I live in Southbourne. We've just left Southbourne <laughs> and we're heading more towards Southbourne. Going to Southbourne. From and, Southbourne. And we've got a butcher, a baker and a candlestick maker. God, I must come around Southbourne High Street and sleaze around a bit. I, if, if the old people aren't dead yet, because I used to harass them in like, like, like the post office. Hopefully it's, hopefully it's the same Bengali fella who owns the post office. Look, close down. Yeah, yeah. Um, close down. Yeah, the kebab shop, Finelli's, Finelli's Pizza, is still oh, open. Yeah, I like yeah. yeah, everyone loves a Finelli's. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Makla, nothing ever stays there. That was Mac the Grove the, once, wasn't Mac it? That's good. Look at the old people, they're still alive. No, they're new old people. New old people, we're always getting new old people. God, I must go visit Siobhan. Uh, she used to work there. She's a very classy Irish woman. Um, aren't they all? Aye. Except for Saoirse. Um, where am I going? We're, go uh, we're, going, to, we're going to Christchurch. Where in Christchurch? Do you know the way? Yeah, you turn left on Carberry Avenue. You know that. You know that. Yeah. You know no, that. No, to the actual place. You know oh, God, no, I don't know where that is. Did you know that Christchurch has the lowest unemployment rate in Britain? The lowest? Yeah, because retired counts as employed. It doesn't count right, as unemployed. Right. And they don't call it God's Waiting Room for nothing. No, they don't. Look at that. We love our coronation. We love our king. Ah, there's Chicken and Blues. Where? Right there, straight Ooh, ahead. And there's Christ Church okay. Cathedral. So we just need to find a park. Oh my God, this thing. If anybody wants to ask for Lacey's social media details, I can put those in the top comment Dude, above. You're lucky I gave you my details, please. <laughs> yeah, don't, don't change your number. I do it old school, like back in the day when you used to go to your dealer, you just rock up to his house, you know? <laughs> you know what I mean? You didn't have to call or text. I used to wake up Mark March oh, 8 30 in the morning. Come on, sell this? me a sell me a 20 bag, dear. 30 minutes, no written. Which cathedral was built? No. Neither do I. Okay. 
Oh, we can just. We're doing brand and tourism. And there's a piece of chicken shit. This will be us over here. They should, at the price of real estate here in England, they should knock these guys down. Everybody who knew them's gone. You know what I mean? Like they should make make way for the new things, like how you how you did some renovations, you know, in the house. It's... You get a nice block of flats on here, couldn't you? Yeah, you could. Big clock. Clock rhymes with. Key. Lock. And key. With a bumblebee. Schmock. Schmock. I can be such a cock. <laughs> Schmock. <laughs> I remember I was eating a chicken and blues when Corona started and you used to have to cough to hide a fart, but then you had to fart to hide a cough. A signature wrap, a Tex-Mex. Is it organic grass-fed? Organic grass-fed, yeah. Uh, and um, it was, it was. They played positive, nurturing music through its whole life as well. The chickens mm, massaged it. Yes, they massaged the chicken as well. Yeah. Didn't think so. No, they didn't. Okay. Mama's sides. Yeah. Anyway, now you remember when you watch the Pirates of the Caribbean movie? There's always a stuntman. Okay, a double there. I'm going to show you right now. Captain Jack Sparrow. When you I was going to see you, I'd be having a shave, so... Or <laughs> we'll being on camera. Right? It's okay, you're not bedding me down. <laughs> okay, but you do look a bit like Jack Sparrow now with the hair there. Oh, thanks. Nice. All right, we got to order some food. Now hurry the fuck up. That's what... Mac, mac and cheese and chicken. Mac and cheese and chicken, mac and cheese and chicken. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to have southern fried just because that's what I want to have and uh, I don't know. Are you enjoying your visit? Am I enjoying your visit? No, this visit. So that is a buffalo wing with a chive and I would think that's a garlic sauce. What do you think, Kerry? Um, is that garlic? It's, it's smoke, pretty... It's pretty zingy. Zingy. Mm. It's pretty zingy. Buffalo. Is, is it buffalo? It is blue cheese. It is. <laughs> It's gonna be. Mm. How long you been off vegan this time? I'm not a vegan. And you never were. It's almost as good as I remember it, but I think the chicken was a bit crunchier. The Caesar, the last time I had one, did not fully permeate the batter. All right. What? In all seriousness, though, was there a hair? What did what? Was there a hair? A pubic hair? Yeah. No, there wasn't. No, I was just I was just trying to get some free. <laughs> Told him there was a pubic hair in my wrap. <laughs> he believed that. He believed that. What are you doing? Oh, you're tying your shoe. That makes interesting content. How, what's it like tying your shoe, Lacey? Get off me! All right. <laughs> Brandon. I'm trying to become a YouTuber. Jesus. What? Don't, don't quit your day job. So you, they were technically watching you. Well, now they're watching me smoking a cigarette, smiling, laughing because I'm an idiot. They're gonna wish me. Now they're watching that's us. The See, that's how YouTube works. Stop it. Now they're watching me. Watching you. Just don't bother. Watching Harry. Just Just don't bother. Bother. You're watching me. I'm watching and now they're watching me too. <laughs> and I've never done it on my YouTube before. Lacey, pull my finger. <laughs> <laughs> no, but you never see pull my finger on YouTube. <laughs> it's brilliant. There's a reason for it. <laughs> I did it like the monkeys. <laughs> oh. <laughs> They're scared to be seen with me. Let's see what properties cost in Christchurch nowadays. That's only 350 grand. That's a. Uh, it's got a bathroom. It's got two recepts. What's a recep? Reception. Oh, reception, like, right. Um, like four bedroom, a four bedroom, two bath. That's only five, five twenty-five, and it's got a balcony. I think these are all quite reasonable. They're quite reasonable for, yeah, for, for Christchurch, yeah. Bungalow, six hundred. Four and a half, six hundred, four eighty-five to live in Stanpit. Burton. Oh, you live Burton. in West Christchurch. Let's go. Yeah, I think the ship maybe, yeah? Yeah, let's go. Yeah, it's Lounge. Do you ever eat in the anymore? Yeah. Is Ludo Lounge still around? Yeah, Ludo Lounge. Yeah, they're all right. Ludo Lounge is okay. 
um, I didn't like it, but now. And what about dirty dirty? No, I don't know. I'll create the atmosphere here, pull my finger. <laughs> no, it's false alarm. I, even I can't do that twice. I uh, sometimes. I thought you could. I can do a lot of things. Twice. Lacey, are you, know, you do massive do. parts. You remember when you were vegan doing vegan parts? Oh, you, you have never had me parts. No, I fucking heard you, you fart. You have never had me parts. <laughs> she doesn't eat your parts. Stop it. Uh, look at this guy. Oh, hello, fella. Hello. How are you? <laughs> have you ever seen cocks on socks? Cocks on socks? Yeah, they're on Instagram. Cocks on socks. No. Yeah, it's they're just normal socks with cocks embroidered on them. Oh, and they're like 15 quid for a pair. Get me a pair. Yeah, they're great. I think it's like... Oh, have you got a pair? I haven't got a pair. Not yet. Do you want a pair? So now we're going into the shit. I didn't really frequent places like this before. <laughs> what are we, we going to have now? Have a ginger beer. So I never told you about my life in England. This is the truth. This is Harry and we're gay. <laughs> speak, speak for yourself. I'm the top. I'm the top. <laughs> he wishes I was gay. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Jack Sparrow. <laughs> Hi, Lacey. I'm not gay. <laughs> yes, you are. You're a band. My boyfriend is. Your boyfriend is. Yeah, can I get a, um, a slimline tonic with um, just a few splashes of Bankster Butters in it, please? In a gin glass. Thank you very much. Is that really? Is that really cold, or is that just painted yeah. on? Oh God, it's real. Oh, <laughs> wow. Should I like ice in that? Yeah, tempting, isn't it? That ice. Ice cold Heineken. Just think of the consequences on a Tuesday night. I know. Go out to Boscombe and be somebody. <laughs> <laughs> what's that Worcester sauce you're putting there? Yeah, I know. <laughs> what is it? Anything else, mate? Anything else, mate? Um, yeah. Can we get, have you got a ginger beer? Pretty please. Pretty please. That's right. Mm. Lovely. Oh, it's, a, it's a premium ginger beer as well. Only the best. Only the best. Thank you. One for yourself? Uh, hi, behind must drink responsibly. No, please do. It's been the only thing you do do, responsibly. Yeah. For many years. <laughs> oh, mm. Look at us, we're like... That's one heck of a round, isn't it? I know, half. Is that bangers? No, we should have had a pint and I would have stood you up. <laughs> no, 0.2% between all of us. <laughs> Time to pull my finger. Cheers, my friend. Cheers, my darling. Cheers, guys. Cheers. 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 It's almost like a good fortune thing, isn't it? If what a it, salt lamp. If you lick it. Lick it now, I'll give you a fiver. <laughs> Go on. No more than that. That's a fiver, cash money. <laughs> Is it a tenner nowadays? It'd be pretty good money. It would be. I think I'm going to turn it off now. So you met Steve, you met Les, you met Ty, uh, you met Stuart, um, <laughs> you met Harry, you met Lacey. And we'll do another one tomorrow. Hopefully we'll meet Anna, we'll meet Pablo. He had to change his name for legal reasons. And we'll meet Desmond. And we'll go to Boscombe Pier. <laughs> Should be exciting. <laughs>